And now it's time for this week's rant. This man, John Howald, was sentenced this week to 18 years in prison, followed by five years of supervised release for shooting into a residence and attempting to shoot others with the intent of ridding a town of LGBTQI plus residents. In March of 2020, just as the lockdown was starting, Howald went on a self-described mission to rid the town of Basin, Montana of its lesbian, queer, and gay community. Howell was armed with two assault rifles, a hunting rifle, two pistols, and multiple high-capacity magazines that were taped together to speed reloading. Howell walked the first victim's residence and fired multiple rounds from an AK-style rifle into her property and home, all because of his belief regarding her sexual orientation. Hoping he had killed her, Howell set off toward other houses to occupied people who identify as lesbian, queer, or gay. Local residents happened to be leaving church and stalled him long enough for a sheriff's deputy to respond. When the deputy arrived, Howell pointed the AK-style rifle at the officer, nearly causing a shootout in the downtown basin, and then fled into the hills, firing at least one round as he went. He was arrested the next day. ATF Director Steve Dettelbach said, Motivated by hatred of the LGBTQI plus community and armed with multiple firearms and high capacity magazines, this defendant sought to intimidate, even terrorize an entire community by shooting into the victim's homes, trying to kill her for no reason other than her sexual orientation. Frightening it is to think if he had succeeded in killing those people. What motivation would that have given the rest of the John Howells of our country to rid their own hometowns of their gay neighbors? It's such a shame that during this pride season, while we're attending the parades, dancing in the clubs, or attending religious services, we have to keep one eye out for the John Howells of the world. Be pride, but be safe. That's this week's rant.